Hey, what's going on guys? John the Video Guy here, and in today's video, I'm gonna go over how to key out green screen in DaVinci Resolve. So if you haven't done it yet, I would highly encourage you to download DaVinci Resolve 17. And in this newest update, they added the 3D keyer effect in the open effects panel. And this is a very powerful and really helpful for keying out green screen video inside DaVinci Resolve. So let's get started here. I'll show you how to work with this and how easy it is, especially for YouTube content creators or people that don't wanna get that advanced with green screen. But before we get started, I would really appreciate it if you hit the like button, it really helps my channel out. And with that, let's get started. So I'm inside DaVinci Resolve 17 and what I have here is a video clip of a woman dancing. So I'll drag that out to my timeline here and you can kind of see this is a difficult green screen because we do have shadows. This is going to be difficult to key out so you know this footage isn't the best so hopefully this does the trick and what I have is just basically like a light thing basically she's going to be dancing in a disco partying hard. So what you're going to do is click on the clip and go to your effects library and go down to under the area where it says resolve effects key and 3D keyer. And we're gonna drag this out to the clip and you don't see anything yet. So it's important to switch here to the open effects overlay. And this will change basically the program view and under the effects tab under the inspector. So make sure this guy is open. The effects open effects and then this is our control. So if we click here and voila, there we go. That's all you need to do. Now, actually, let's refine this a little bit more and they added some cool features into here. So what you can see here is there's the eyedropper tool with the plus button. And what you can do is actually draw lines in the areas where you want to increase the keying out of. So, you know, you can do the sides here. You can see kind of how it's updating and those parts of the key or the green are going away. So. I'm just gonna do a bunch of squigglies because I like just drawing and making a mess. So here you go, you got some squigglies here and that's pretty good. But if we zoom in here, you can kind of see there's green around her body. So what's really powerful and probably the best feature here in DaVinci Resolve and this new effect is called Despill. So check out the magic. Once you click that, it basically replaces the green with a matte or some type of decolorating, decolorating effect where it replaces that leftover green with basically another color or subtracts it out somehow. So that is the magic in this effect. It's really powerful. You don't have to have a really strong background and keying. So, you know, it's great for content creators and different people that don't want to really dive into green screen. Uh, you can see I did this really quickly. I mean, this is going to end up being a very short tutorial. I'm at four minutes right now. So this is great for people that don't have to add several effects or get really into keying and refining the key for green screen. So this is great. I hope this tutorial has helped you if you're looking for an easy green screen remover inside DaVinci Resolve. Feel free to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.